Hello friends, welcome to Blessed Excellence Center. Do it to subscribe to our channel. In our last class, we looked at the reaction of Grignard reagents with propanol. In today's class, we are looking to consider the reaction of Grignard reagent with esters. Look at this reaction here. We have CH3, COOCH3. We call this ethyl ethanoid. It's actually an ester. When it reacts with methyl, methyl magnesium chloride which is a Grignard reagent in the presence of acid hydrolysis what will be the product that is what this video is going to detail us in the next seconds all right look at the reaction here we have ch3 c double bond o then o ch3 that is methyl ethanoids what my video on nomenclature and you know how the name is formed okay all right in the reaction mechanism the double bond here one of the bonds here will be cleaved this way giving the oxygen in red a negative charge and the carbon here a positive charge coming to the Grignard reagent we have methyl magnesium chloride it's a Grignard reagent when you cleave this bond this way according to the direction of the arrow the metal group in red will be negatively charged and the magnesium will be positively charged the next thing will be the exchange of charges. So, according to this arrow here, showing you that the magnesium chloride that is positively charged will be attached to this oxygen that is negatively charged. And that leads to the formation of OMGCl. The next thing is that this carbon that is positively charged will pick this CH3 metal group that is in red. And then when you attach this as this arrow illustrates, you attach this metal group to this carbon, you're going to have this. And this is an intermediate that is formed in the course of the reaction. In the next step, we're going to repeat this and add water to it in the presence of acid. And now we'll lead to the next step. Look at it. This is the intermediate we formed in the previous step. We repeated everything the way it, the way it was in that formula over there. Okay. Now in this compound, when the bond between oxygen and magnesium is cleaved this way, according to the direction of the arrow, the oxygen in red will be negatively charged and magnesium will be positively charged. Coming to water, this is H2O being water, this is H plus proton from the acid, okay? Well, that is why we call it acid hydrolysis. When you cleave this bond this way, the hydroxyl group will be negatively charged and hydrogen will be positively charged. Having formed that, the next thing is for them to exchange their charges. So the hydrogen here that is positively charged will be attached to this oxygen that is negatively charged. And that leads to the formation of O and H. The next thing is this OH that is negatively charged will be attached to MgCl that is positively charged and that leads to the formation of HOMGCl which we call hydroxy magnesium chloride and then every other component is repeated the CH3 here is repeated here the CH3 here is repeated here the OCH3 here is repeated here and we call this 2-methoxy-2-propanol it's actually an alkoxy alcohol so that is how Grignard reagent reacts with Esther. Do well to subscribe. Thanks for watching.